Man, it's been good. Uh, you know, just really excited. Um, you know, to be around uh, these coaches, these players, uh, just really be a part of Seminole football. Uh, you know, I'm really excited about that. When you had the opportunity to, to transfer and go to another school, why was Florida State the the, the choice? Uh, just because of the program they built here, to be honest. Uh, you know, I, I've had a chance to uh, see Florida State up close and personal two times. Uh, you know, first year, uh, it was in 2011, I was a freshman, but uh, Champ Sports Bowl, uh, and I liked the tenacity they played with. Uh, and then the same thing this uh, this uh, past season, um, you know, be playing against them and kind of seeing what they were about, seeing the culture that they built here. Uh, you know, it, it's really something special about this place. I guess first from the Notre Dame standpoint, what was that game like last year? I mean, that was definitely one of the best games of the college football season, even though the, the result wasn't what, what you wanted at the time. What was that game like? Uh, it, it was a fun uh, fun environment, man, to be honest. I mean, I think, uh, and this is just my personal belief, uh, you know, football, it, it, it's something to be said about football in the South. Uh, you know, they really appreciate it and really, uh, you know, are passionate about it. So, um, you know, it was a very fun environment. Uh, you know, the fans were absolutely crazy. <laughs> so, uh, it, it was good, though. I mean, football players are notor notoriously hard on each other. Has anyone kind of mentioned that game? Yeah. Has anyone tweaked you about that? Yeah, yeah. I mean, we, uh, you know, it, it's, it's more of like a fun debate now. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're, uh, you know, I had so many players come up to me, you know, with, uh, you know, asking, you know, whether we thought, you know, we should have got the call or, you know, what it may be. So, uh, you know, it's all in fun. Now. I think, uh, you know, their, their biggest comeback for me is what you hear now, you know. So, uh, you know, like I said, it's all in fun, and I'm happy to be here. Jumping in, having to learn a, a new playbook, what's – is there a big difference between what Notre Dame did and, and what Florida State does, and what's – what are you really trying to, to pick up right now? I think the biggest thing is uh, different terminology um, and dis different philosophies. Uh, you know, we were responding – I know, you know, this is praised as being, a, you know, pro-style offense, things like that, but, uh, you know, we were responsible for a lot at Notre Dame as well, um, you know, checking protections, um, sometimes, you know, audible to different plays. Uh, so we were responsible for a lot as well, but I think the biggest thing right now is terminology and understanding a different philosophy, understand uh, their uh, different approaches to the game. Um, and I think, uh, you know, for me coming in uh, two months ago, you know, that's kind of where I've been uh, thus far, just trying to uh, understand that playbook and really uh, continue on that grind and, you know, trying to understand uh, their philosophies. I think we've heard a lot of people say what they kind of expect from you, what do you expect for yourself? What kind of quarterback do you see yourself? Uh, I, I expect nothing less than, you know, me being great. Um, you know, I, I set my expectations very high for myself, uh, and I'm probably my biggest credit, uh, to be honest. So uh, I always, you know, took the approach that, you know, if, if you set your, uh, your expectations high for yourself, nobody else can really uh, infiltrate that and really affect you. Um, you know, because uh, at the end of the day, I want to be the best player that I can be, really. So, um, you know, that's what, I, what I've came here to do. Um, that's what I, uh, you know, really kind of uh, look to really enjoy the process. Um, so I, I think that's big for me. I know Sean McGuire left the, the spring a, as the starter. How has he embraced you coming in here, and what has your guys' relationship hey, been it, like to start? Uh, it, it's been good, man. There, uh, there's no animosity towards each other. Um, you know, despite what people may think, <laughs> but it, it's been it's been uh, it's been good. You know, he's been another guy that received uh, you know uh, the competition well. Um, you know, there's been times where we're uh, involuntary seven on sevens, and you know I'm asking him questions, and you know he's giving me the answers, um, things like that. So it says a lot about his character, uh, but as well it says a lot about uh, the culture that they built here. As far as from the running backs and the receivers that you've had a chance to, to throw the ball to, hand the ball to, uh, what, what, what do you like about the talent level here? It's there. <laughs> it's there. I mean, it, it, it's, you know, uh, yeah, I don't know too much that I have to say about that. Uh, you know, like I said, uh, you see the guys that they recruit. Uh, you see the guys that they get here. So uh, the talent level is definitely there. Finally, uh, fan day today. The fans are, are watching this online. You had a chance to... Uh, to, to go meet them for a couple hours, sign autographs. Are you looking forward to kind of introducing yourself to uh, yeah, to, to yeah. the Florida State fan base? Yeah, different little family, huh? Yeah, I, I mean, I'm excited, man. I'm excited. All right, thanks for joining us.
Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, one more thing. Uh, Coach Fisher talked about his experience when he was a player transferring in mm-hmm. and trying to win a starting job. Have you talked to him about that? Was that yeah, something that actually, you had? Yeah, he actually did talk to me about that and basically told me, uh, you know, just to kind of keep your, de- your head down and, and, and work your butt off, really, um, and, and come in here and uh, nothing's going to be given to you. Um, and I think he, he made that apparent, but, uh, you know, you earn your respect. And so I think that's what I've done um, was come in here and really try to earn my respect uh, and, and really just, like I said, work my butt off. Was that helpful for you to have a head coach who had that exact same experience? Yeah, yeah it is. Uh, I think, uh, you know, even him just kind of talking to me about that and uh, pulling me to the side, I think he's been a tremendous help for me as well. Um, you know, just kind of building that uh, connection. Um, you know, we, we really came a long way, um, which is kind of different for me. But, um, you know, I think uh, us having that connection um, allows me to uh, be a better player.